Find yourself seated in a comfortable chair. Your feet are flat on the floor, your spine is comfortably straight, and your palms are resting gently on your knees or your thighs. Begin to take some slow, long, deep relaxing breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. With every inhale, feel more light and peace entering your body. And with every exhale, feel like you are letting go of all tension in anything you do not want. Continuing to breathe gently and deeply, feel a wave of relaxation beginning at the crown of your head, moving down throughout the entirety of your head, your face, the back of your head, your neck, your throat. Feeling this wave of relaxation moving down through your shoulders, relaxing your arms, elbows, forearms, wrists, hands, and fingers. Feel this wave of relaxation moving down through your shoulders, upper chest, upper back throughout the entirety of your ribcage, your heart, your middle back. Feeling this wave of relaxation moving down through your abdomen, your lower back, through your hips and groin. Feel this wave of relaxation moving down through your thighs, your knees, your calves, your ankles, and out through your feet. Feeling more and more relaxation moving through your body, from the crown of your head all the way through your body, through the tips of your toes. You see a light moving through your body, starting at the crown of your head and moving down all throughout your body. Letting go at a deep level as you see this light increasing in your body and you feel the peace and relaxation increasing as well. Letting go deeper and deeper, down and down into relaxation where you feel so good, where you feel so peaceful and at ease. All cares and worries are leaving you now. Feel yourself relaxing deeper and deeper, down and down, into relaxation where you feel so wonderful, so peaceful, so at ease. Letting go deeper and deeper, down and down into the safety of relaxation. Picture yourself in a beautiful meadow. It's a nice, beautiful spring day. The temperature is perfect. The sky is clear, save for a few small, white, fluffy clouds floating lazily by. The sunlight is pouring down upon you and is filtered through the tree branches so that you feel absolutely wonderful on this beautiful spring day in this gorgeous meadow. You feel the presence of your guide. Now you may know your guide already, or you may never have worked with your guide, but you know that you have a guide. It's a guardian angel that's specific to you. Very personal guardian angel that knows you better than you know yourself. Knows what makes you happy, 
knows what makes you sad, knows what your functions are here, your talents, everything that you've come to do here as a soul. Your angel is eager to help you. Angels never come uninvited, so if you are ready for this guardian angel to help you, invite them. Invite them here now. They may appear in physical form. They may feel like just an energy, a feeling of safety and wisdom. Just know that they are real. It's a high vibration, an angelic vibration, a celestial vibration. Your angel signals you that it wants to take you into another realm. Your angel opens up a portal and you easily walk through it with your angel into a realm where everything is permanently perfect. Everything is light and beauty. Everything is joy and perfection. Off in the distance, you see a beautiful, brilliant temple, a temple made out of light. You approach this temple of light with your guide. And you enter easily. Your guide signals to you to move to the throne room within this temple. As you enter this room, you see a beautiful goddess seated in the center of a room on a beautiful throne adorned with jewels and gold and silver and light. You recognize that half of this goddess is veiled. She has an open book in her lap. You can tell that she's very beautiful. She looks up and beckons you to come into her presence. Your angel stays back and allows you some time alone with the goddess. She's a larger figure than you are. Standing up, you only come up to about her lap. You gaze up into her face as she lowers the veil. And you see the most beautiful light, the kindest, most loving face. You know that this goddess is a goddess of pure love, pure compassion, and is all wisdom, all understanding. She turns her book to you and bids you look into it. She tells you that on these pages that she's opened to, this book is all about you. As you gaze into the book, you realize that they are not words like you are used to seeing in written books, that it's a living spirit, this book, and it's dancing with vibrant energy. This vibrant energy communicates directly to you. And you start to see what is revealed to you from this book about yourself. How much more you are than you really realize. How much greater you are. How important you are. How essential you are. You realize that you have a divine function to fulfill. And this book tells you all about that. Spend a few more moments gazing at this book, allowing the spirit in this book to inform and instruct you in ways that you've never been instructed before. You 
The gaze began at the goddess's eyes. She tells you that she is mystery and that she is secret. But in this great throne room, in this temple of light, she can lower her veil for you and allow you access to all wisdom, all understanding. She asks you to think about your deepest secrets. Anything that you are ashamed of or are afraid to tell yourself or other people, she bids you to open up that part of your mind to her and allow her to know your secrets. There might be things filled with shame that you did or that others did. Parts of yourself that you think aren't good enough. Places about yourself that you're very impatient. Just allow her to see. Allow your secrecy to be revealed. Keep nothing private from her. As she is the goddess of all understanding, all compassion, all healing and pure magic. Now she bids that you tell her what your secret desires are, the desires of your heart. What do you truly want? What do you want more than anything? She reminds you that all true desire of the heart is there to be fulfilled and is sacred and righteous. And any desires that are not sacred and righteous are easily disposed of by just allowing them to fall away in the presence of this goddess of wisdom. goddess asks you to give her your desires, to allow her to fulfill those desires by planting them as seeds into the deep fertile grounds of the universal mind. She reminds you that in your world things take time, and even though in her world they have manifested immediately. In your world, they can't manifest immediately, at least not all the time. Allowing them to come forth in their perfect season, at their perfect time, is true wisdom, because this is what your world needs and requires. So you have all patience because you know that it's already happened. Your desire has already been fulfilled. In the goddess's world, Everything that has already been fulfilled is just a matter of time in your world. And you look with great excitement and joy upon your future as you know that your desire is coming to pass in the perfect way and at the perfect time. She also reminds you that she's always available for you. You can come back and visit her in her temple any time you want, any time that you have a new desire, or any time you have any secret, or problem, or shame, or guilt, or blame. She can transform all of that, and she can also give you all of the righteous desires of your heart. She's always available, and she's extremely happy when you come to see her. For now, you know it's time to leave her presence and to return to your world. 
So you thank her. You look again into her eyes and you see the joy and the love and the compassion of this goddess. As you say farewell, your guide joins you and starts to lead you again out of this temple back through the portal and into that beautiful meadow. You're so grateful to your guide, your angel, for helping you. And just for now, you're saying goodbye, but you know that your guide is always with you and never leaves you. Little by little, you start to feel like you're back in your body completely. Sensing the floor beneath you and the room about you, you gently start to stretch your body, open your eyes. Take a few deep breaths, being here and now. And if it's appropriate for you to do so, out loud you can say the words, Blessed be. Blessed be.